our revolution. The Czech Republic in the heart of Europe used to be called Czechoslovakia and for almost 50 years it was a totalitarian zone occupied by the Soviet Union. Then in 1968, the Czechs rose up against the Soviet control, but it was soon put down when the Russian tanks moved in. Twenty years later, in 1989, the Velvet Revolution took place when the country's freedom fighters rebelled once again, and this time the revolt was one with peace and nonviolence. That's why it was called the Velvet Revolution. It was primarily led by architects and artists called the Linkhart Foundation and the new found freedom they had never known before came out in an explosion of a mix of arts and politics. Get out of Praha, all the tanks out of Czechoslovakia. It's over. All the tanks were rolling out when the Rolling Stones rolled in back last year around May. But they was wondering what's going to happen to the tank monument, the monument to the Russian liberation of Czechoslovakia, an original Russian tank standing out on a high pedestal to remind always the sitting tree about the great heroes. So what to do about it? What happened? The people came out. The people came out and surrounded the green tank and they protested. And then what happened? Some people from parliament put on some overlays and just got on top of the tank. Started painting and painting themselves. Station, Franz Kafka Wall. I like this wall a lot. They asked me, "What do you want to do the mural at, Mario?" I said, "Malostranska, Malostranska Station." Malostranska, wow! You know, that's the only place you will see some art, but no murals. It was an easy painting. This I did not get the permit in time, but I went ahead anyway and did what could be called there one of the first murals inside uh, Praha. And the students helped me out, as you can see on the far side. Then we went on to the John Lennon Peace Mural, in which I was given the honor to paint the portrait of this man, part of our lives. We lived in a dark world, underground, and now, along with all the messages of new thoughts and new passions and new choices that have to be made. So this Lenin comes like a Christ. <laughs> 